Hello, welcome to Recall Gaming Exploits, and this is the great Steam refund. So, I pre-ordered Batman Arkham Knight against my own advice. Prior to the release, I did post up on Twitter and other things I think I might mention in a video or something. Uh, not to pre-order the game, or not to pre-order games in general, because, you know, most of the time, you're going to have a hard time. Um, I went against my own advice, because, frankly, it's Batman, and I'm weak. Um, I did tell people not to pre-order the game at all, because... Once I found out that there was no review code for the PC, I knew that there was going to be something wrong with it. But I went against my advice anyway and continued with the pre order powered through. And. Because I'm, I'm weak and silly. And now I'm going to show you what we do when we do weak and silly things. When we're purchasing games as consumers, especially when they come out as broken as this. Uh, I do hope that it get fixed soon. I will, I'll, I will purchase the game again. I will. I'll, I'll pay again uh, to get this game. As and when it's fixed, and in a good working order, which will not have limited 30 FPS, will not drop below 30 FPS. I mean, I'll be getting drops that have gone lower than 20 FPS, as you can see from my uh, previous video, which shows the Batman Arkham Knight gameplay. But yeah, this is what we do. We go to Steam Support, yeah? And we go to the refund section. Hello, look, you go to... And then you just click on, oh look, gameplay or technical issue. Bosh! Okay, so, I've requested a refund, and I am refunding it because the frame rate is too low. The game frequently drops below 20 FPS in spite of my PC specifications surpassing the recommended specifications for this particular game. Submit request. Your refund re request has been received, and that's that. So, uh, yeah, when things start messing you around like this... Just refund it. Let them know that they are in the wrong for messing consumers around like this on a regular basis. With any luck, if we keep complaining about poor ports, about bad, badly running games, about games that run badly at launch, and this, and I'm saying it's not just for the PC fans, even though we've just recently got the power of the Steam refund, to console players that watch as well, do the same. If the game doesn't work properly, you buy a game, pre-order it, and it doesn't work properly, send it back, get a refund, say the game doesn't work properly. It's buggy. They didn't produce the product that they promised. And hopefully, if we do that enough times, they'll stop releasing games before they're ready, like way before they're ready, and actually do some quality control, like they're supposed to, and produce the product that we expect from them as game developers and publishers. With any luck, I'll stop rushing them out of the gates because, frankly, and I'm speaking on my own terms here, I would rather wait an extra couple of months or however long it takes to get a game that works smoothly and doesn't have any game breaking issues or major bugs. I'd rather wait and get a quality product than pay for a two bit channel. It's actually insulting that they would release such a game. But yeah, thank you for watching Recall Gaming Exploits. Get stuff here on the channel. Talk to you do, and I will see you soon. Goodbye.